Hey everybody, welcome back. Another request from yourselves. Let's dive in. This is Sue from Galnerius. Um, and I hope I, I hope I pronounced that at least halfway right. And Fuhi, which lead singer of Unlucky Morpheus in Doll's Box. Now, I know I've heard songs by Galnerius before. And I know I've heard many a song from Unlucky Morpheus. With Sue from Galnerius not familiar with this song which is reason let me know if you've heard it before if it's the first time you're hearing it as well let me know in the comments at the same time if you've heard it a million times before let me know what you think of this song let me know if we should check out more that that we should do for definite and i think obviously once we get through this video we'll see if there's any comments below because i'm, I'm quite enjoying that part let me know if you're enjoying that part where i've been looking finding some well not finding scrolling down and reading some of the comments from from their video let me know what you think of this song let's dive across Let's do this. It's always going to be massive, massive on the guitar, right? Got to be. Of course it is. There she is. Come on, come on. Where are we going with this? Oh, oh, oh. Quite, quite far back in the vocals for now. Oh, that guitar on the drums, here we go. Do we have lyrics? We don't have lyrics on this one. Oh, beautiful vocal. Now, when we talk about skills on the guitar, Oh, beautiful. Oh, I love that vocal. That operatic presence in her vocal is always there. Serious drums as well, man. Beautiful. Perfect vocal to feature on this track. Perfect. <laughs> oh, I need to I need to listen to this more. <laughs> Wonderful layers on that vocal. Ooh. I have no words. I just, it just love this. Why is this the first time I'm getting to hear this? This is incredible. I love how he separated up his melodies on the guitar. That fantastic variety in the melodies has been epic. And those solo licks, man. <laughs> the skill. There we go. Oh, this! If you're if you can play this on guitar, I tip my hat to you because that is incredible. Picking his way through that. Oh my god. I would love to see this performed live. <laughs> it's incredible.
Oh. Loving that accompanying vocal. I'm just blown away by this performance, if I'm honest. I love her voice so much. Her voice is just incredible. Incredible. I just wish I had some translations for the lyrics as we were watching it so I could follow what the story is in the lyrics. The visuals are just mind bending. This guitar work is in insane. Insane. Oh, what a way to end. What a way to end. Right. I mean, let's just start with what we know. Fuki, you know, from Unlucky Morpheus, Dollsbox, you know, with the vocals in Unlucky Morpheus, that is very much how I coined it was Vampire Metal. You know, this wonderful, fantastic vibrato in our vocal, which is straight out of some kind of wonderful opera. The way she throws those notes around just so perfectly in these melodies and the scales and just effortlessly effortlessly the guitar work on that track was incredible now galnerius i have heard tracks from so i was already expecting awesome that leveled up those guitar solos the riffs nothing about that song was uh, overdone and it would have been very easy to do everything felt perfectly placed you know this solo work could have been overdone but it wasn't it was just incredible and you could listen to that again and again and again and when it finished i was ready for another solo i, I expected another solo at that point i was like it's going to be a stab and i'm going to start again i wasn't ready for it to finish that was absolutely mind-bending and i would love to know what the song was written about I'm going to have a read about that after this. We'll have a look through um, some of the comments as well. Let me just let me just get the glasses. That helps when I'm dealing with comments this size. That's cool. So we'll, we'll start with the, the top comments. So Japanese metal will be amazing so long as Galnerius and Unlucky Morpheus continue making music. I mean, there's, there's a statement right there. Fuki's vibratos are the most satisfying thing in the world. It's almost like she has a whammy bar and a vocal <laughs> vocal cords. And that comes from Jinx. And the previous comment was Austin Weeb. Now, I mean, Jinx, I agree. I absolutely agree. Because that instant... But how, do, how do I phrase it? Like, the vibrato is held perfectly. There's, it doesn't start and follow a certain tempo and it's the wrong word to use and then slow down and speed up it doesn't it's a perfect vibrato um next one down is kane 18 at 2 minute 13 you know she's a goddess when her voice can do a harmonic dive bomb let's 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 do let's hear the harmonic dive bomb this is just incredible in that look that she gave after the notes like yeah I did that. I did that. That was incredible. Let's face it, we knew we were going to get something awesome, and I feel like we definitely did, and even more so. Let me know if you enjoyed that song. If we should check out more, let me know. That was incredible. Much love from me. Let's do this.